What's going on guys, it's your boy Chaos bringing you guys another video. I'm going to continue the same series man, this is uh, Buffalo Bills, um, this is Bunch Quads. Uh, Bills is a really good playbook, it's got a lot of stuff, a lot of meta stuff that people use. So I'm going to try to go non-meta here and show you guys something that probably you haven't seen as much. It's got a bunch of quads. I'm going to start off with QB draw. Because you get Michael Vick a lot, you get Russell Wilson, you get fast quarterbacks. And this uh, quarterback draw is really good. So, I'll show you guys versus Tampa 2. And something I noticed from QB draws is they don't fumble when they're on conservative. Unlike scrambling. If you're scrambling with your quarterback, you will fumble on conservative. But QB draws, they treat them like a running back. So I'm going to take hits and you guys are going to see I'm not going to fumble. Um, let me get off that guy so he's actually playing. But... QB draw is really good. You get really good blocking. It's just like the uh, running back draw. Obviously, there's going to be a user. You just pick whatever hole that they don't pick. Um, I can pinch the line for you guys, show you guys it still works versus that. And it's just a really good, solid um, solid run. Uh, you just got to pick your hole. He shed right there. Uh, but it's it's a nice way to mix in a run when they're not expecting it, probably, since you're in five wide. Uh, show you guys one more time with the pinch line. Still works well against the pinch line. I picked the wrong hole last time, so. Five, six yards. If I had better run stick, we would have picked up more. So, that's just that. I just want to show you guys quickly that you guys can go to that. Especially if you have somebody like Mike Vick. He will eat for you. Um, my favorite play out of here is inside post. Now, something about this formation is similar to the bunch of Y that I showed you guys in Atlanta. Is it's going to ISO that left side receiver. So, let's put the middle linebacker in a deep blue. Put him in Carl Flat. I actually took him off his mid read, but it's not a big deal. That's not what I'm showing. So the cloud on the left's gonna man up, and you're gonna have the drag and the crosser open. You got a shed, but you can see it's butt naked. The guy on the left's manning up. I should go to the replay and show you guys. I don't need to show you again. Um, no mistake. So on this left side, you have a fade, and the cloud's manning up to it. So you have this crosser, going to be naked, wide open in the middle of the field. And then this drag, um, the vertical hook mans up to it. Um, but regardless, you can throw either one, whichever one's open, whichever one they're not lurking. Um, and then you have this backside post, I meant to show that as well. This backside post gets to a really good spot as well. Um, right here, you can pass these down, throw it in right here. Um, and that's with the purple there that's kind of bumping it out. So it's a good play. I'll show you guys again against uh, cover two. Um, actually going to come out in uh, cover 3 cover 4 to so show you guys you can still throw the other stuff um, and then I'll audible down to cover 2 we'll go out of cover 3 audible down to Tampa 2 see here and you can keep trying on a route if you want I just like an extra guy blocking Smax Pro see the drag there and then you see this post here so you have 3 really good routes and then now I'm in cover three. Let's still see these crossers get to good spots, these drags get to good spots, and that post still gets to a really good spot. Um, backside post. Fit it right in. That's Earl there, so in case you guys are worried about 91 zones, still fits. Same thing, max protect. And that crosser's still naked. They're shedding me right now. This is a good shed defense if you don't pinch it, uh, if you don't pinch your line. So let me just spy a couple guys just so I can show you guys the reads. You will have time to throw this stuff in um, in game. It's just practice one has a lot of sheds, and then it's automatic. It's already a good shed defense. So I mean, good throw, good throw from Russell right there. But you see, it's open. I don't need to show you guys any more from that. Uh, that's the main play. Um, that and the QB draw, and then something you can mix in too. Similar to the one from Bunch Wide is this spot right here. So quickly jump into cover three. Cover two with the deep blue is going to act like cover three somewhat uh, when you're throwing. Just not not in a general sense, but just really against this route here, this post route. So And then you can drag that, fade here, fade here, drag him. I mean, do I like to keep the flood, and then you can do whatever you want with circle and R1. Or, I mean, if you want to block someone, you can do this, you can do this. I mean, really, the route's square, and then you have a flood concept. So, similar to before, you see it gets to a nice spot. It's going to get underneath those deep blues. It's 91. 
Oh, Thomas, and as I mentioned in the Falcons video, it's better to have someone with low route running as opposed to um, as opposed to someone with high route running because it's going to take them longer. It's going to give the, the deep blues more time to back up. Um, I'll show you guys one more time. You have the flood concept with the right. I don't need to show you guys a flood concept. If it's hard flats, throw the, throw the corner. If it's opposite, throw the throw the corner. I mean, throw the flat, so... Show this three spot for you guys one more time. Show you guys it was a fluke. Just a really nice spot. Bam, fit it right in there. So that's it, guys. I mean, both plays are good. I like post uh, inside post better, but spot's good too. Uh, if you guys like the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And take it easy. Peace.